Hello, my friends. Welcome to your science class. Today's topic is sources of light. Luminous and illuminated bodies. Have you ever observed what happens when day turns into night? When it becomes night, everything becomes dark and we cannot see objects clearly. On the other hand, during the day, the sun illuminates Earth and allows us to see everything around us. Bodies that emit or give off light are called luminous bodies. The sun is the most important luminous body for our planet. The sun, the light bulbs, and stars are all examples of luminous bodies. When the sun or another luminous body lights up an object, it allows us to see it. It means that without them, it wouldn't be possible to observe to the characteristics of the objects. If not, you can turn off the lights and you will see that you can't see because there's no light up there. How are objects that emit light called? The sun, the light bulbs and the stars are luminous bodies? Why? How are objects that are lit up by luminous bodies called? Is your chair an illuminated body? Why? Is a firefly a luminous body? Why? Please reflect, reflect about this information and let's continue watching the video. The objects or bodies that are lit by a luminous body are called illuminated. For example, your notebooks, pencils, and backpack are illuminated bodies. It means that they do not emit their own light. In order to see them, you need to have a light close to you. You have to turn on the lights or you have to, to be outside. Here we have a fun fact. The moon is a satellite of Earth that does not give off its own light. It shines because the sun illuminates it. So, the moon is an illuminated body. Did you know that? It doesn't emit its own light. I hope you liked all the information. Thanks a lot for your attention. See you later, alligators. Bye-bye.